Hey everyone, welcome to yet another video by WG Production. So this video was a one requested by one of my subscribers, and this will be a simple tutorial teaching you how to add a rotation or a revolution uh, around your logo because uh, this can be confusing uh, in the beginning. So I'm going to teach you this, and uh, in the next part of this video, I'm going to show you how you can make a 3D logo uh, out of this uh, because this one is 2D and it's rotating around the y-axis. But the next tutorial is going to be about 3D uh, logo or a 3D coin spinning, so you can use it in your intros. So let's get straight into the video. So before moving forward, if you haven't already subscribed, then please subscribe for more amazing content and like and comment below this video as it really helps grow my channel. So I have a new composition over here and I'm just going to go ahead and import my logo over here. And uh, let's just go ahead and increase the size for this logo. So as you can see, I've done this. And now what I'm going to do is uh, by pressing F4, you will be able to see these options over here. If you press F4, so you can use uh, just press F4, or you can uh, just right click over here and select columns, and you can select modes and switches. So switches is the one that we want, uh, as we have this 3D effect over here. So once I just click on this logo over here, I'm just going to go ahead and just click this button over here to give it a 3D effect. So now what I'm going to do is press R on my keyboard to open rotation, and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and rotate this y-axis as you can see over here. So what I'll be doing is uh, basically just uh, keyframing this over here and then at around 2 seconds I'm going to go ahead and press uh, 4 for this because I'm, I want to have 4 rotations over here, 1, 2, 3, 4. And in order to smooth out this, uh, this animation is good enough but in order to smooth out this animation I'm just going to go ahead and edit the speed graph for this. So by clicking this uh, Y rotation over here I'm just going to go ahead and edit the speed graph. So if you want to select the speed graph then you have to select right click over here on this blank portion over here and select edit speed graph so make sure that you have this so we, what we want to do is just go ahead and make a curve over here uh, curve something like uh, this uh, yeah just something like this as you can see that we have a fast rotation over here and then we have a slow rotation so once we go back and we play this animation then we can see that we have a fast rotation and then we have a slow rotation just like so and our animation has become a lot smoother with this just by editing the speed graph on this. There you have it. So in the next tutorial what I'll be doing is I'll also be showing you how we can make this uh, logo into 3D and then rotate this also a coin that you can rotate in 3D which will be the, about the same animation. And we can, we'll also see a great text effect that works for our YouTube channel trailers. So let me know in the comments if you found this tutorial helpful and I'll see you guys in the next video inshallah.